Here's an update on something interesting at uh, Florida Tech. And a few years ago, I put in this Astracarium murumuru. And I didn't know what, um, whether it was a male or a female. And um, by those little pseudo spades or whatever those things are, you can, it looks as though male flowers are coming out. So it's expressing as a male. And then I come over here to the long-term resident um, Astracarium Mexicanum. And I had always assumed in 26 years that this was a male. I've been coming here since the mid to late 90s, and I always thought this was a male. But for the first time in forever, ever, I should say, that we have uh, seeds on this one. So my uh, assuming this was a male was, was wrong. So I'm guessing that the Murumuru made a love connection with the, uh, with the Mexicanum, and now we got seed, which is really cool. Uh, and if somebody pilfers the seed, that's great because there'll be hybrids uh, growing out. Morphologically, they look very similar. Um, that uh, this is still probably really young, so the leaves are a little more entire. Uh, and, whereas this one's starting to get more um, uh, pinnae, open pinnae on them. So anyway, I'm really excited because again, I've known this tree for a couple of decades and uh, now it's got fruit on it. And I suspect, again, it's because, because these are uh, dioecious and they cannot um, self-reproduce, that putting that murumuru in, uh, which turned out to be a male, has uh, contributed to what we see now. So anyway, I'm excited, as you can tell. And this, again, is at Florida Tech.